An amazing day, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another edition of Auto Review. I'm Ron De Los Reyes, and today I'm coming to you from one of my favorite places, Baguio City. It's been three years since we had a chance to visit this uh, paradise of a place. And uh, thank you to Honda Cars Philippines for inviting us to join the all-new Honda BRB test drive. And uh, Honda BRB now comes with the Honda Sensing technology. It's one of the best features of the car and uh, we were able to test drive it as we moved from Pasig City all the way to EDSA and then uh, NLEX, SETEX and uh, TPLEX before going on a more uh, challenging route. It's not Canon, it's not uh, Marcos Highway, it's the Asin Road. And Asin Road offers a lot of uh, challenges to any vehicle. And uh, I was surprised with the more powerful engine of the Honda BRB, and also the spaciousness inside and the comfort uh, it offers to uh, drivers and passengers. Welcome back to Auto Review and on our test drive, we join our colleagues in the media and Honda Cars Philippines in the test drive of the all-new Honda BRB. <music> Honda Cars Philippines Inc. or HCPI flexed the power and capabilities of the recently launched all-new Honda BRB in a 500-kilometer drive to and from the City of Pines. Complemented by Baguio's spectacular scenery, the test drive demonstrated the BRB's driving performance, improved comfort, and the Honda Sensing suite of safety features in the VXCBT Honda Sensing. Morning. Uh, we're here very early today for the test drive of uh, the all-new Honda BRB. We're excited to do this because we haven't been to our destination for quite some time. We are going to Baguio. This will be a very good uh, test drive for the all-new Honda BRB. Our drive started at the Grove in Pasi. to EDSA, NLEX, and on to TPLEX. To make the drive more challenging, the organizers brought us to the more twisty terrain of Asin Road, an alternate route to Baguio. Asin Road is ideal for passenger cars, SUVs, and pickups, as its series of curves and hills and downhills can be a test not just for the vehicles, but more so for the drivers. We drove smoothly and with sufficient power from the BRB's versatile engine, bringing the convoy to the Asin Tunnel and back to the very challenging mountain roads. Alright, uh, lunchtime here at the hill station. We just arrived in Baguio. 
We drove for about uh, four hours and a half uh, from uh, Pasig City. It was a good drive, very good acceleration on the highway and uh, very comfortable. And of course, uh, when I drove, uh, starting at uh, Rosario in La Union, I enjoyed the drive going to Asin Road. A lot of twisties, but the new BRV responded very well. It has a uh, more powerful engine and uh, very nimble on the road and uh, very nice also on uh, the tight uh, curves. I like it. Honda's latest seven-seater SUV takes a departure from its predecessor, with the all-new model flaunting a strong SUV appeal. With its higher ground clearance, dynamic body shape, set of available 17-inch alloy wheels for CVT variants, and its newly designed LED headlights and taillights. Notably, the event's test drive units also showcase the genuine accessories available for the all-new model. The all-new seven-seater also shines in terms of practicality thanks to its spacious cabin that has been significantly improved for both second and third row occupants. We also took advantage of the flat folding seats which became useful in loading our baggage. For in-car entertainment, the new BRB features a 7-inch touchscreen display audio that supports various functions such as Bluetooth, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and USB connection. Climbing up the steep winding roads of Baguio via the Asin Road was a breeze for the all-new BRV with the ever-reliable 1.5-liter iBTEC engine, which now features DOHC, delivering the best in class 121 horsepower and 145 newton meters of torque. The engine is paired with a new continuously variable transmission or CVT. We also noted the recently concluded fuel echo run with the Automobile Association Philippines that attested a 24.71 km per liter efficiency of the 1.5B CBT, 23.49 km per liter of the top of the line 1.5 VX CBT Honda Sensing, and 22.62 km per liter of the 1.5 SCBT. We also had a chance to experience some of the state-of-the-art safety features of the Honda Sensing such as Lane Keeping Assist System, Adaptive Cruise Control, Collision Mitigation Brake System, Road Departure Mitigation System with Lane Departure Warning, Departure Notification, and Auto High Beam. Beautiful drive of the all-new Honda BRV, a great improvement from the first generation of BRV. This has a more powerful engine now. Before we had a test drive of the first gen Honda BRV in Baler Aurora, and uh, it was also a challenging drive. But uh, now going up to Baguio was uh, more challenging, uh, and uh, I'm surprised that uh, the Honda BRV rose up to the challenge and uh, we did not have any difficulty doing the very tight and twisty roads of uh, Asin. That's one of the new routes uh, going up to Baguio. And I had a chance to sit at uh, the rear, second row of this uh, seven-seater. Very comfortable, 
I noticed that when we did the approach to Baguio City proper, the ride was very stable. You're not being thrown around. Uh, you stay in your place uh, without much uh, movement. And uh, I like that because uh, when you bring a family to a trip like this, comfort is of utmost importance, as well as safety. When it comes to safety, this is one of the safest vehicles around because of its Honda sensing technology. That's a uh, technology introduced by Honda to its other vehicles like the CRV, the Civic, the HRV, even the Honda City. Something that I think uh, should be standard not only to Honda but also to other uh, vehicles that are going to be produced in the future. We had a chance to talk to Mr. Masahiko Nakamura, on the Cars Philippines President. Now we are in the Baguio. It's very cold and very cool. Uh, now we are conducting the test drive event of the all new BRV. We came here from the Manila. It takes about four and five hours. And with the new BRV, you can feel the how powerful of our powertrain and how comfort and how big is the cabin space. And also now we have a Honda Sensing. That is one of the uh, advantages of the BRV. The all-new BRV was launched last November 2021 and it features the all-new design from the exterior, interior and also a new engine. So it's now equipped with a 1.5 DOHC paired with a CVT. So it delivers uh, a powerful yet fuel-efficient consumption for uh, city and highway driving as well. For the all-new BRV, it comes with a 7-seating capacity for all variants from the VX, V, and S grades. So the VX and V grades have um, leather seating capacity and uh, while for the S grades, it's uh, equipped with high-grade fabric. The long drive was followed by dinner and a fun fellowship night. I declare the bar open. <laughs> My huckleberry friend, Moon River, Run River, that's me. certainly had an exciting test drive for the all-new Honda BRB. Here's our car price watch for the all-new Honda BRB. I'd like to thank Honda Cars Philippines for inviting us to take part in this uh, very exciting, interesting test drive of the all-new Honda BRV with 
Honda Sensing technology. It's very beautiful and very capable and very safe crossover and uh, I hope you also get a chance to test drive one from one of Honda's dealers in the country. Until next week at the same time here on Auto Review, this is Ron De Los Reyes saying thank you for joining us. Drive safely all the time. At mula po rito sa Baguio City, maraming salamat po. This has been another Auto Review feature. Thank you for watching.